Hello, today I am assembling the SPT-100. For this project you will need a Phillips head screwdriver. Step 1 for this project you need an ABS plate, the red servo horn, and four 3 8 inch Phillips head plastic screws. You attach the servo horn to the smooth side of the ABS plate. Take note that the servo horn is not symmetrical. One of the arms has four holes whereas the other has three. For this plate, you'll want to position the four hold arm so that it's on the top right and the bottom left. Second step, you need the other ABS plate, another red servo horn, and four more of the plastic screws. Again, this servo horn is not symmetrical. However, for this plate, you'll want to position the four hold arm so that it is on the top left and the bottom right this time. The next step is to attach the ABS platform using the one half inch black Phillips flathead screws. You'll attach that with the textured side up to the ABS plate that we had just assembled. Next you need the black servo mounts and two one half inch black Phillips head plastic screws. You'll attach those servo mounts to the other ABS plate that we assembled first. For this video we're using Hitex 485HB servo. You attach that to the output shaft of the servo that has the servo mounts on it. Once you have that in place you'll attach your second servo to the top using the four 3 8 inch black truss head screws. Again, once that's in place, you'll attach the other ABS platform to the output shaft of the servo. Before locking this plate in place, you can hook the servo up to a controller and make sure that it's in neutral position. This will uh, make sure that you have a full range of tilt. The SPT-100 is now ready for use. If you have any questions about this project, please leave us a comment. Don't forget to like and subscribe so that you can see some more videos. Thanks for watching.